so supplemental winter feeding uh, with uh, primarily with hay. Um, one of the things that we do is um, it's a lot easier to feed hay this time of year, September, October, early November, because we're not as wet. Um, so in the barn behind me over here are, are our fall cows. Um, and so they're, they're actively calving at this point in time. And so we brought them off of our pastures and we're feeding them hay right now and letting our pastures regrow so that we can stockpile that grass. And then once it gets a frost on it, it increases the sugar content. So whenever these cows are done calving in uh, the first of November, we're gonna kick them back out of this, of this area and they're gonna go back out on the fescue pastures, which have been stockpiled. They've had a frost on them. The sugar content is almost through the roof. And so they're gonna have better nutrition on those fields then when it's wet and it's harder to feed hay in a conservation friendly way. Um, so we're feeding the hay here in the barn on concrete, we're collecting that manure, we're distributing that manure where it needs to go, primarily back on hay fields where the hay came from originally. Um, and then in the winter time, we're not out rutting our fields up by, by packing hay out into the fields. Um, we do always have to feed some hay out in the fields. Um, and when we do that, we use hay rings, um, or we also use uh, unrolling. So we'll unroll the hay out on the pasture. Um, and it depends upon the scenario. If it's really soupy and wet, um, if you unroll the hay, in our experience, you're gonna have a tremendous amount of waste. Um, and you wanna unroll hay, basically you wanna give them one day's allotment at a time if the ground is not frozen. Um, and so if, if the ground is not frozen and it's really wet and soupy, then you've gotta pack hay out every single day to keep it to where you're not losing a bunch of hay. Uh, so when, is, when conditions are like that, uh, we hope to be grazing stockpile. Uh, but if we're not able to graze stockpile for whatever reason, then we're gonna feed hay in rings. Um, and so then we can feed maybe a week's amount of hay on one day. We can get out there while the ground is frozen one early one morning or something. Uh, but if conditions are right, we really like to unroll hay because it spreads those nutrients out in those pastures so much more effectively. And I think we get, when the conditions are right, uh, we get much better utilization of the hay and less waste.